Hello, my name is Jamie Hudson. I'm a whole school inclusion teacher working for Suffolk County Council's Specialist Education Services. I believe that education in school promotes equal opportunities for all pupils, whatever the age, the gender, ethnicity, attainment and background. The whole school inclusion team are currently promoting the Inclusion Quality Mark Award, providing Suffolk schools with an opportunity to complete a nationally recognised validation of their inclusive practice and ongoing commitment to developing education and inclusion. The, Inclu the Inclusion Quality Mark Award helps to celebrate a school's current practice, but also provides an opportunity to challenge. It pays particular attention to the provision made for and the achievement of different groups of pupils within a school. Suffolk would like to say a big thank you to the 40 schools that have registered to complete the Inclusion Quality Mark and welcome any schools that are interested in joining over 5,500 nationally that are completing the process. For further details about this award, please see the link found on this webpage. I think inclusion means acceptance of everybody and being able to provide opportunities for everybody, not just in schools, but in, in the community as well. I think it really allows schools to celebrate what they're actually doing right now. Uh, it's completely different from an Ofsted inspection and what it really does allow are for any school to become an inclusive school, whether they are an outstanding graded Ofsted school or requires improvement. Any school can complete the award and be successful um, in, in, in providing that inclusive environment. That there are many schools that think that they're going to complete the award and that's going to drive their way forward. But actually, the award helps to celebrate and provide staff with recognition and that, you know, that pat on the back for doing a, a really good job currently. I really enjoy working with the whole cohort of the school, from the children all the way up through to the, the SLT, the head teachers and the governance. Um, what I particularly enjoy is that light bulb moment sometimes where you're offering a solution to a problem in a school, um, you provide that support and the end result shows that not just on a small basis, across the whole school, you've got a positive result and uh, children are then able to access more than they may have been able to do before we'd got involved. The inclusion quality mark um, takes most schools about a term to complete from registration all the way through to the assessment. There are eight elements that need to be completed on a, a self-evaluation form and each element takes about two hours uh, to complete once you get started. Um, the whole school inclusion team are there to support the schools through the process and the end process is an assessment day where an IQM assessor joins the school and um, completes an assessment on various criteria following the elements, but it's more of a celebration of that school in that day. I think children get to show the, the, the greatness of themselves and the school. Um, the assessments that I've been involved have been so positive and the stars of the show have actually been the pupils themselves. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Barneveld. I'm Senko and Inclusion Lead at Woodhall Primary School and at Holsworth Valley Primary Academy. Um, since we've done the IQR Award in both settings, both schools have found it amazingly helpful in terms of celebrating the inclusive practice we already have. Um, and it's also given us some really, really helpful next steps to ensure that our settings are as inclusive as they can be as we move forward. Hi, I'm Danielle Swain. I'm a Senko over at Burton and Primary Academy and we have just completed our IQM award and received our report. Um, we found the whole process really positive and really helpful and really just celebrated all the successes at our school in one place. Looking ahead, some reflection on our IQM award is just looking at how we can develop all staff and some big changes coming up this year and developing all those, all those new staff joining us so we can continue that inclusive ethos. Inclusion is um, welcoming everyone and making sure they feel like they're worth it and enjoying who they are as a person, no matter like what they look like, what they do, their behaviours and uh, things like that. And it's also about like, what they do as well. So like um, 
I do diving, so including me because I do diving, like having people who like, I have friends who like go do sewing and friends who do like sports, it's just like having a wide range of like people who do stuff.